Straight back past the bowler for four. No ball as well, so that'll be five runs. Great shot again from Tendulkar. What a treat this is to watch. Drives beautifully through the covers. Andre. Goodness me, that is a terrific shot. Couldn't get down in time to uh, stop that boundary. Just slightly overpitched and disappears. Back past the bowler. Brings up the 50 stand as well. A straight drive. Always easy. <laughs> and it continues. Then a run away for four as well. Only just, but it will. And so it goes on. 98 for two. Drives through the covers, fractionally overpitched, and that's put away in style. He's batting outside his crease now to try and negate some of the swing and the movement. And he goes after that one, and it's six. Just using the pace of the bowler. But there was no half measures there from Tendo. Schwabachter, fast and furious, allowing uh, the batsman that with and Sachin Telunka has cashed in on it big time. That's gone away in a flash. That is cricket at its best. Being made to stretch and uh, really heads off for middling that wide one from his left. It's almost a bit like a tennis player. No, talk about timing. Don't bother moving and he doesn't. To 70 now. Shot. What a shot. Fantastically played by Sachin Tendulkar. Down the ground for four. Well, this is the little master at his... Besides the thread one here, and I was just about to say, that is the difference when you have someone like Verinder Saywag in your side. Consistent. Here's the change of pace that Ian Bishop was on about. You could see it was the off-cutter, the slower ball, the off-spinner. Oh, they love striking boundaries.